This is the terrifying moment a gunman opens fire on a pub after he was refused entry for being drunk. The man fired a bullet at a crowded pub in Harbin, Birmingham. He then fled and was arrested at gunpoint after a high-speed police chase, Birmingham Live reports. Lee Emberley became angry at door staff who refused him entry into the boozer. He then shot at the pub and was chased by police in an astonishing video that has been released by officers. CCTV captured the moment Lee Emberley angrily shot at a pub. Image, SWNS.com, Emberley was refused entry because he was drunk. Image, SWNS.com, he was then chased by police who arrested him at gunpoint. Image, SWNS.com, he was escorted away from the entrance, and crystal clear CCTV footage shows how he reached into his waistband, pulled out a black revolver and fired once into the air as he casually walked away. The bullet smashed through the window of an upstairs bedroom at the pub, where a family with children sometimes sleep. Luckily no one was hurt. Embley, 42, then got into his car, parked a few meters away and drove off. But firearms officers in the area were alerted and quickly spotted the vehicle. When they tried to stop Embley, he made off at speeds of up to 80 miles per hour on 30 miles per hour roads. Lee Embley was jailed for eight years for firearms and ammunition offences and another year for dangerous driving. Image, SWNS.com, police recovered gun and ammunition. Image, SWNS.com, Embley had left the gun on the ground when he fled. Image, SWNS.com, he led police on a chase for nearly three miles before crashing into a no-entry sign where he was arrested. Body-worn video from the officers shows the moment they spotted the Colt .41 double-action revolver, made in around 1912, lying on the road next to the car. It had two bullets in the barrel, and one spent cartridge. Embley told police he had drunk eight cans of strong cider and eight double brandies before the shooting and did not know where he was when he woke up in a police cell. He pleaded guilty to nine charges following the drama, which unfolded around 9.05 p.m. on January 13. Emberley drove 80 miles per hour on 30 miles per hour roads in a bid to escape police. Image, SWNS.com, the chase lasted almost three miles. Image, SWNS.com, Embley told police he had drunk eight cans of strong cider and eight double brandies. Image, SWNS.com, when the gun was recovered it had two bullets in the barrel, and one spent cartridge. Image, SWNS.com, at Birmingham Crown Court yesterday, he was jailed for eight years for firearms and ammunition offences and another year for dangerous driving. Embley, of no fixed address, was also banned from driving for six years. C.C. Ian Leach, from the complex crime team, said, this was a completely reckless shooting which could easily have resulted in the death of an innocent bystander. Embley then put further lives at risk by driving while massively over the limit and it is by luck rather than fortune that no one was seriously hurt or killed. Thanks to the excellent police work by the two firearms officers who spotted the car and then put their lives on the line by confronting Embley, we have taken another weapon with the potential to kill off the streets. Gun crime is a top priority for West Midlands police, and the sentence handed down shows that anyone who thinks it's acceptable to carry or use these deadly weapons will face the force of the law when they are caught. Last year, the force seized more than 140 firearms linked to crime in the West Midlands. Anyone with information on firearms can ring the force on 101, or Crime Stoppers in complete anonymity on 0800 555 111.